As we speak, DCR DEX 0.6 is entering into its final round of testing and packaging before its imminent release. With so much to look forward to, it's a great opportunity to recap on what's been happening behind the scenes. Firstly, three DEX proposals are finishing up voting to see the work continue on the project for a coming year. And this includes countless new features and implementations. These improvements will lead the way to the first full stable release of DCR DEX version 1.0. DCR DEX is aiming to become a fully featured multi-chain wallet where each project has its advanced features exposed, enabling users to participate in more aspects of a given project. The plan is essentially to pivot from a DEX trading app to a state-of-the-art multi-chain wallet backed by Decred's DEX network. Features include privacy participation, staking, governance voting, and so much more. To my knowledge, this will be the first multi-chain wallet to expose advanced features of each project listed. Generally speaking, multi-chain wallets tend to be limited to storing, sending, and receiving coins. With DCR DEX wallet, you'll get all of these extra features peer-to-peer -peer without the need for intermediaries or custodial services. This, in my opinion, is the next evolution of interoperable cryptocurrency tech. One pair that most people have been looking forward to is the Ethereum pairs and their stable coins. Both are coming and are already undergoing rigorous on-chain testing. Whatever your views of stablecoins is a feature that a lot of Decred community members have asked for and having the ability to use the most popular stablecoins with no bloat to the Decred chain is extremely beneficial to the project and any other project that wants to build these pairs. In my view, interoperability means you can take advantage of all the new and exciting stuff happening in the cryptocurrency space without taking on the risk, burden and contention associated with such products. DCR DEX is this gateway. With the availability of the new Litecoin and Bitcoin Cash built-in wallets, users will no longer be limited to the Bitcoin BTC pair for moving in and out of fiat currencies. Currently, the Bitcoin blockchain is heavily congested. So for those that need fiat on and off ramps, we're subject to paying higher mining fees and longer wait times. With these new pairs and their internal wallets, will have a wider range of fiat liquidity to choose from at much lower mining costs and much lower wait times. Fidelity bonds are replacing the registration fee. Fidelity bonds require users to lock up funds before they can participate on DCR DEX. These funds can be redeemed at a later date. This helps make sure all participants act in accordance with the DCR DEX rules and failure to do so incurs penalties. Fidelity bonds are a prerequisite to the DCR DEX mesh server and will help to make sure server operators are subjected to the same rules and penalties as their users. The DEX is getting a major user face overhaul. This is to make the software suitable for a wider range of devices, including mobile, and to make the user experience more friendly as more wallet features and pairs become available. After the implementation of Ethereum, DCR DEX has a reusable code base for other EVM assets, including Polygon. Polygon has been chosen for an early integration because of its super low fees and high activities, including stablecoins like USDC. Digibyte is another integration that offers the project a few benefits, including its large active community, demonstrated recently when a Twitter post highlighting Digibyte was coming to DCR DEX saw a major hike in views to over 20,000 views with lots of interactions and positive comments. The FIRO community, including lead developers, have also expressed an interest in being added to the exchange. To expose DCR DEX to the widest possible audience, packages will be developed to make the process of installing a lot easier and more familiar to everyday users. In general, Windows and Mac users don't start programs via the command line or file explorer. They expect to install a program that creates an application icon and opens the desktop application. To start with, desktop apps and installer programs will be created for the major platforms, Windows, Mac, and Linux. There is also an Umbrel package being developed for the Umbrel personal server, but unfortunately, integration into their app store has come up against some censorship issues. Currently, DCR DEX can be added as part of a community app store, but not as part of their main Umbrella app store. While the DCR DEX supports a wide range of assets, bootstrapping liquidity markets for these assets can be challenging. 
Without built-in market maker bots provided with DCR decks, only market makers with the resources to create their own bots will be able to provide liquidity. By offering an easy to use market maker bot, any user will be able to provide liquidity to any market. This creates opportunities for earning coins that many will find attractive. A decentralized network of market makers will lead to truly healthy markets. The two types of bots that will be available are a maker bot which places orders on both sides of an order book at a certain distance from the current price and an arbitrage bot which watches DCR DEX and a centralized exchange order book and places orders on both if there is an arbitrage opportunity. Binance and Bittrex will be the initial exchanges supported by the arbitrage bot. As the scope of the multi-wallet functionality expands, so does its target audience. For this reason, discussion started around giving DCR DEX a name change to make the product more inclusive to the cryptocurrency space at large. One possibility that's being considered is to rename the client to Bison Wallet and the exchange network to Bison X. With so much development, it's hard not to be enthusiastic about the project's future. After seven years of active production, Decred continues to build some of the most innovative, permissionless, decentralized, non-custodial tech in the space. DCR DEX, although built by Decred, doesn't require Decred to use the exchange. DCR DEX is a peer-to-peer -peer decentralized exchange that aims to remove the middleman.